Hi there and uh, welcome to another video tutorial. Um, this is a sort of a practice one here that I wanted to try out um, sort of uh, recording from a flash interface. I mean it's got some buttons going on here and a little bit of animated graphics and uh, my web uh, address so I'm just sort of playing around here but uh, I might post this for a while anyhow so uh, let's have a look. Um, when you first go to start your dissection you're going to want to uh, pick up your uh, gloves here and there's some boxes of gloves uh, that will be available for you. Um, you're also going to need to make use of water, the tap here, washing off uh, your frog uh, to get off some of the preservative and uh, we've got some soap. You don't want to put that on the frog itself but uh, you can wash the dissection equipment and at the end of the dissection and of course uh, wash your hands as well. So it looks like a happy bunch of students uh, ready to get into the dissection. Alright so once things are underway um, you are going to put your frog uh, into a dissection tray here and that's what you'll use to uh, do all your manipulations. Uh, you can also pin the frog down and uh, I can't see it very well but there is a dissection T-pin there holding down the, uh, the flap of skin. Um, another thing I want to really point out that you need to make use of is the lab manual right here and uh, there are special books for the frog itself and there are of course uh, manuals for other organisms. Uh, but you'll be needing to read through this. Um, there will be some questions to answer and uh, there are various diagrams and steps and stuff like that that you can follow to help you through on the dissection. And, and finally on this image here I want to point out uh, the dissection scissors which you'll be using. Um, you won't be given scalpels so use the scissors to cut through the skin um, and as well you got another piece of equipment here which is a dissection probe. There's another one sitting in the in the tray here which is a, it's a blunt probe and it's got sort of a rounded edge and it's curved and you use it for teasing apart materials and stuff like that. So um, I'm going to end this little mini tutorial here by just reminding you that uh, you'll want to be examining the uh, external anatomy of the frog as well in addition to the internal stuff. Make sure you know uh, the different outside parts and inside the mouth and definitely make use of your manual as this good student is here. So I hope that helped. See you soon. <laughs>